Welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you guys how to do a nice high puff ponytail using this beautiful curly puff hair from Amazon. I'll be going from this look to that look. Let's get into it. The hair we are about to be using guys is a afro puff drown string ponytail it's from amazon and it's from this seller called icy queens i don't know if i'm saying the name correctly and the name of for this bun it calls icy queens afro puff drown string ponytail black kinky curls hair bun synthetic hair piece clip in hair extension for black women and it is an extra large bun in color 1b and now we are about to get started make sure your hair is freshly washed and clean i washed my hair yesterday now it's nice and clean we will be using oil in this poster james just to slick the hair as much as you want again is your options is your preference you are welcome to use whatever you want to use on your hair just as long as you get the hair to be slicked down that's all that matters but for some reason, I'm not going to really pay that much attention to trying to slick my hair down because this high puff ponytail is pretty large. It will be covering my whole entire hair. This is the booster jams that I'll be using. And as you can see, I'm here fighting to um, kind of like put my hair together. My hair is kind of like my hair is kind of like similar to the same texture of the hair which will make it look a lot natural again guys i will not be using too much product in my hair i just want to put the hair up and put the ponytail on top of it because as i stated this ponytail is so huge and it's so beautiful it's going to be big enough to cover my whole entire hair and which i like that so much you know sometimes a woman just gotta be on the go she doesn't have time to be wasting and doing no baby hair doing any extra accessories she's just gonna throw it on and go and this hair this is what it does and i'm here just like make sure that the front just a little flat which i didn't have to do that i don't even know why i'm here trying to do any baby hair it might not be even showing when i put the hair on and on top of that i'm not trying to use the got to be glue that i have here to try not to do any baby hair anyways because i will have to wash my hair again which i am not looking for also if you are new here welcome and if you happen to click on this video welcome as well and please like and subscribe to this channel and support your girl Rubika. and i do want you to be a part of my team and please again don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel after all, I am happy the way the hair came out. So now let's get ready to put this ponytail on top and see what we can do. So we will be doing a lot of different style with this hair. So let's get into it, guys. You know what I'm saying? So this is how the hair is right here. There is a strain and it is elastic where you can open it pretty wide. And like I say, guys, this hair is pretty big if you're looking for a large extra large bun this is the one to go with i'm telling you i was so surprised when i took it out the bag but i was like uh, i don't think i'm gonna like that but once i'm starting to put this hair on i'm like maybe we can do a lot of different things with it so let's let's give it a try so let's see how we work it a comb in the back and one in the front and one on each side of the hair which is so good it makes it so easy just to clip the hair together and the, as i stated there's one in the front here and it would have been so much easier if i had actually had braided um like a cornrows on the knee of the ponytail like a round cornrow so next time this is what i'll be doing because i feel like for some reason since my hair was a little bit sticky and i had blow dry my hair last night when i tried to put the comb into my hair and it wouldn't stay really because it's just kind of like keeps sliding back up but i kind of manage it to make it stay maybe next time i'll try and just do like a little like a small tiny cornrows underneath of the hair the perimeter of the hair and my hair is pretty
pretty thick and I'll cover my hair with it and then however the style that I'm looking for and then it will definitely stay and it'll be more secure. It's just my options, you don't have to do that. And this is the first options here. So let me know in the comment below guys what you think about the first options. I like the first option so far. I think it looks pretty nice. And now we are working on doing option two. I'm just trying to figure out what to do with this hair. And this is the option two here. It's not much of a difference. I just kind of push the front back a little bit and just kind of like show a little bit more of my hair. And the first one was like the, the puff was just pretty much like more covering the front of my hair. It's not much of a difference, but it is an also option. So, and this is the back of the hair. This is how the back look. And again, guys, this hair looks so natural. It looks so much like it's my own hair. Once I put this hair on, you can't even tell that I am wearing a ponytail or a puff ponytail. You can't even tell that I'm wearing any one of that. It looks so natural. It matches my hair color and the curls. It's just beautiful. And this one here is option three. I just kind of like bring the side down a little bit more. I'm kind of loving the option three, really. We are shooting for option four and this is just a regular afro which it filled up my whole head and like i said this ponytail or this afro ponytail it's super large and it's big it's extra large that's what it says on the package it is worth it you can make yourself so many different style with it it's worth it and i I believe it was only $16.99. It was not expensive, guys. It's so cheap. You get enough for your buck, honey. Enough style for your buck. And now we are working on style number five. How it comes out. Again, can you tell that I'm wearing a piece? Can you tell that I'm wearing an extra piece? Let me know in the comment below. You cannot tell that I'm wearing an extra piece. It is super natural, especially if you're just running or if you go to work, you're going to work or you go to school, you just throw it on and go, honey. You don't have to do much. You can just be sitting in the car and just keep pulling it out. You can actually even braid your hair underneath of it. You know, like maybe braid your hair down or up and just like put the ponytail on top and every day you get up and just put the afro ponytail on top and you just be ready to be on your way it's pretty convenient really really and truly also guys i don't know if i did mention that before but i just want to apologize i'm using a new camera i'm trying my best to learn this camera so bad so in case you realize that my video is looking a little bit yellowish but i still look good that's all that matters but i will get to know this camera so i can give you guys a better view you know what i'm saying look at the back of this hair guys let me know in the comment below look at the back of this hair and look at the back of my hair can you see the difference there's no difference it's exactly the same color in the same style of my hair texture i really like this hair i do i like this hair i'm definitely gonna get my mother one you guys can tell i'm enjoying this hair like look at that smile like what prettygirl.com y'all prettygirl.com she has confidence she has confidence yeah, yeah. I think this style will be a number one choice for me whenever I'm wearing this here to go out. So definitely a yes. And now I'm just gonna like changing up a little bit. 
by pulling a little bit of more hair. If you don't like hair into your forehead, then you don't have to do that. I like this style as well. It's a definitely an A plus for me, this one, definitely. who told me to do this option six look at option six guys it's not much of a difference with option five but just to bring the little hair into my forehead like it's just gonna change my whole look i am in love with option six as well i think option six it changed to my option one i really love it i love the way it makes me look it makes me look like a beautiful barbie like look at her Look at this beautiful girl. Let me know in the comment below what you think about these options. Let me know which one that you prefer, which one you like better. I'm loving it. All right, now let's switch it up. Let's try to switch it up to another options. This is option seven, yeah. And also again, guys, I will link everything in the description box below. So you will have the hair link. So you are welcome to click and buy it. It's optional to you. This hair is not sponsored. I'm just letting you guys how I feel about this hair. Don't get me wrong. It wouldn't be a bad option if you purchase this hair. the last options guys i'm gonna just stop at option nine i know there are so many different styles you can keep doing with this hair but i'm gonna just stop right there i think that i have enough with this hair and i already imagine so many different style i can do whenever I'm, i decide to wear this hair i really like this hair so much and thank you so much for watching and i hope you enjoyed this video and please don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more video and there will be some few pictures at the end look at those dimples look at those dimples so give her a thumbs up thank you so much for watching again and see you in my next video bye